championships and competed in three NCAA tournaments, including two Final Fours and a national championship game appearance. Please direct your attention to the video boards for special video and... came to UConn in 2019. Her athleticism and energy have been key for the Huskies in the last five seasons. She made an immediate impact as a freshman, was named the all-conference tournament team. Aubrey was a 2023 All-Big East Honorable Mention selection. Aubrey totaled 916 points and 626 rebounds in her career at UConn. Aubrey graduated last May with a degree in women's studies and is currently pursuing minors in HDFS and urban community. Escorted by mother Audrey, stepfather Scott, brother Alan, and grandmother Audrey, a Ford from Ossining, New York, number 44, Aubrey Griffin. Nika Mule has been an X Factor for the Huskies. Nika's a two time Big East Defensive Player of the Year and all Big East second team selection. Last season, she set UConn records for single game assists and season assists, as well as most double digit assist games. And tonight, Nika became just the fifth Husky in program history to reach 600 career assists. Nika is currently pursuing a degree in psychology, escorted by her parents, Roberta and Darko, a guard from Zagreb, Croatia, number 10, Nika Mule.
Aaliyah Edwards is one of UConn's most consistent players. She's her third team All-America, Big East most improved player, Big East tournament most outstanding player, all Big East first team, WBCA all region, Big East sixth woman of the year accolades. Aaliyah has totaled 1,695 points and 929 rebounds in UConn. Not to mention she's a member of the Canada, Canada, Canada basketball and a 2020 Olympian. Aaliyah is currently pursuing a degree in communication escorted by her parents, Jackie and Eddie. Forward from Kingston, Ontario, number three, Aaliyah Edwards. Paige Beckers has been a record breaker since arriving on campus. She was the first ever freshman to win the Wooden Award, Naismith Trophy, and AP National Player of the Year honors in 2021. She was a consensus All-American. She's a two-time NCAA Final Four All-Tournament team member. Paige Shai Maya Moore is the fastest Husky to 1,000 career points, currently sitting at 1,369 points. 323 rebounds, 343 assists, and 151 steals. Paige currently pursuing a degree in human development and family sciences. Escorted by our mother, Amy Fuller, father, Bob Beckers, and siblings, Ryan, Lauren, and Drew. From Hopkins, Minnesota, number five, Paige Beckers. Let's hear it good and loud for the seniors. What a special group and a special night. Large majority of the folks stayed for the we, ceremony, we which did. was terrific. Lots of tears I've seen around the arena. Yeah, and uh, there they are. Aubrey Griffin, Aaliyah Edwards, Nika Mule, and Paige Beckers with uh, Gina Oriema. We'll hear from all four of the players as they address this uh, Gamble crowd momentarily. So uh, stand by for that. Yeah, and it's a first that they're doing it post-game. Right. And a lot of people are asking questions why. I mean, you can see you can, you know, you can let it run and, and yet, and you can play it out a little bit more, but the kids get to talk, which yeah. I think the, the, everyone is really, really excited to hear what they have to say. And uh, the student managers re recognized as well, getting in uh, the photo op at uh, center court. Yeah, I, you know, again, when you're trying to get ready for the game, I can, I can feel already what a difference this makes and what a, how much more emotion can play into the night because the game is over. Now, of course, you're always risking if something goes wrong in the game, but uh, this has been fun and a very emotional and uh, very heartwarming, too. It's really, it's why they why they do it. It's why they're here. They, they Yeah, they play basketball, they win a lot of games, but it's the relationships that you make and, and the bonds that you form that will never go away. And, as the years pass, you don't remember the details about the games, but you remember the, the fun you had at practice, in the locker room, on the bus, in the dorms. Sure. And the relationships that form between the families as well of this uh, this shared journey through four It's years. really hard for the parents. And, and since I'm there ages now, <laughs> yeah. uh, you know, they're here for four years, and then that's it. But a lot of them keep in touch. And, but it's a huge change for them. 
One more year is the champ. Yeah. Now, of course, all have eligibility left due to the, the COVID year rules where everybody was granted an extra year of eligibility. And Paige with the, uh, the season-long injury. All right, getting the microphone ready, and Nika Mule stands first. Um, I don't think there's ever enough time to say what I really want to say, and I speak for everybody. Um, but I just want to thank everybody. Um, I just want to thank everybody that's here watching this game. I want to thank everybody that's at home watching this game. I want to thank everybody that's going to watch this game tomorrow. <laughs> and I also want to thank people. <laughs> I also want to thank people who are not able to watch our games but still love and support our team. We would be nowhere without you. This program would be nowhere without you all. And it's been an honor and pleasure to play in front of you. And. I wouldn't trade you guys for the world, man. You guys are family. <laughs> and thank you so much for showing us what it's like to be a part of something this big and this great. And um, I want to do a special shout out to our family section and to our families. so much I, words can't explain it and we love you all so 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 much and we're not done so have meant to me the best student section in the country. Thank you, guys. Um, obviously, this four years didn't go how I planned or how I wanted it to go, but I wouldn't trade it for the world. Um, I, I wouldn't be able to get through what I went through without everybody here um, just supporting. Um, so thank you to the best fans in the country. I know uh, everybody wants me to address the elephant in the room. Um, unfortunately, this will not be my last senior night here at UConn. I'm coming back.
support the rest of the season, um, and we'll see you soon. Breaking news. Breaking news for sure. So Paige Becker is putting the exclamation point on what has been a wonderful night. And, uh, and we're not done yet. Still lots more to come. Uh, stay with us. Chelsea Sherrod will uh, talk with some of uh, those involved. <laughs> Good stuff. Uh, did UConn Nation just get a real jolt of energy? <laughs> they certainly did. And, and I, I like the way Paige said it, to address the elephant in the room. Yeah. Well, that was the question, right? Since they sent out the, the social media photo of um, the four that would be on your honored on.